Hey everybody, it's Roach, and this is They Are Here, Alien Abduction. Now, we're a journalist, much like an outlast, except this time all we have is a flashlight, and we have to get down to the truth of what's going on at, Sh I think it's Sherwood Farm. Somebody has been abducted by aliens, and we need to try and get a photo of those aliens, so we can write an article about it. Um, we have to go talk to the farmer. Oh my gosh, look at this road. This looks creepy. Ooh. Okay. Oh, look, 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 we got a news van. That's so cool. Channel one news. Um, to, to be fair, for a demo, uh, the, the, the art and everything looks really, really good. I like it. Oh, can we not run? What does I say? Sherman's farm. Where's my flashlight? Oh, that's the strange lights. Left mouse button to take a photo. There you go. Shake it till you see it. Did that help? This is great material for the news report. Can I take it? Thank you. Oh, that's a creepy cornfield going to the house. Can I go that way? Maybe I shouldn't go that way. Where's my flashlight, man? It's not F. Crouch. Can we crouch? Oh, we can crouch. That's crouch. We can't run. Apparently. Something just happened behind me. Huh, ah, okay. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, there's a note on the door. That's brilliant, isn't it? Oh, we can see to that house. This kind of looks like one of the house. Oh, Jesus, look at that scarecrow. It kind of looks like one of the houses from Phasmophobia. Uh, let's read. Mr. Fox, we made an appointment, but something bad happened. Our daughter went missing. My wife went to town for help. My son and I went to check out the farm. We'll leave notes for you and the police in case we pass each other. Be careful. Peter Sherman. Okay. Oh, I can't take that. I gotta put that back. Can I go inside? Take phone. Oh, it's not working. Okay. Can I close this? Yeah, I can close. I don't want any spooky... Dookie aliens sneaking up on me. That looks like Paul Rudd. Kind of, not really. Hey, the fellow members of the Sherman family. Can I go to the fridge? There's a step. Old newspaper. This old newspaper has information about UFOs and crop circles. These phenomena have been seen throughout the state for a long time. Why... I never knew about this. Okay, I'm really surprised. Like, nothing zooms past any of the windows. Can't go in there. I don't think, uh... Mr. Sherman said you could go around his house. Journalist, man. I don't know our name. Um, in the phone, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just gonna say the same about all the foes, I think. What is that? What is that? A pipe? Make sure we close doors. I just think it's, I just think it's smart. Why not? Oh. Oh. Alright. Apparently now we, uh... We need to hide. Printed photo, photo from the internet. Perhaps Peter Schumer saw something sim similar. It looks creepy. I mean, yeah. Yeah, it does look creepy. Okay, yeah. It's gonna say all the same stuff. Farmer's Children's Diary. Sticker. Found my old diary when I was 15 years old. How could I forget that? Diary text. Today was the most exciting and scariest day of my life. I saw the aliens. My parents think I'm lying, but it's true. I was fishing from an abandoned pier on the river. Suddenly, I was deafened by a roar coming from behind. I turned around. Very low above the ground, a huge disc with full flashing lights or windows was hovering. 
felt a punch that seemed to throw me into the air. I froze there, as if in zero gravity. Everything around me became blindingly bright and I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing three aliens with grey skin and big eyes. I was placed on the table as if I was welded to it. They were standing over me. It seemed to me that they communicated with each other te telepathically. Then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening and barely made it home. My head was buzzing and I walked home as if in a delirium. When I got there, I found several cuts on my body and two small, very smooth holes behind my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. He might be a little crazy. Uh, well, I mean, the aliens are quite obviously here. So it's probably not crazy. Look at this. Oh no, we're not going. Why is the music on so spooky? Oh, that was scary. Just opening the door. Oh, why don't we open the door? Oh, there you go. Okay, there's a little walkie talkie. Apparently, it belongs to the missing girl. If you listen closely, you can hear very strange sounds. It's the aliens, man. I'm just about to look outside. Can I see any aliens? Are we gonna see any? This is one of those things where you don't see stuff. Oh no, uh, goodness sake. Farmers know this is my doll's room. During the night, I heard a strange noise when I came in. She wasn't in her bed, and the window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. Okay. Oh, God. That's a... That's a... Spaceship! Uh, can I get out? I can't get out. I'm locked in. Uh-oh. Okay. Alright. I know where to go. I know exactly where to go. I thought that was going to behind me. I sh pooed my pants. I'm hiding in this wardrobe until like forever. I don't feel safe. I don't know what to do. Okay, I'm just gonna have to go. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna have to go. I don't have a task or anything. Okay, so this door is open now. These are just photographs. I'm not looking at them because it's just going to say the same thing. Blah, blah, blah. The Sherman family. Put this on. Can I move? simple. Abduction. I only remembered the alien abduction when I found my old diary. It was then that the migraines began. The cuts that I noticed then behind the ear were a trace of them. I'm sure they have implanted something in me. Some kind of transmitter or implant. Because of this, 
Oh, we got everything. I definitely decided that I would get it. I'm not crazy. Alright. What is this? Little Joe with a strange device. In the note that you claims that he cut out the in implant. Maybe take it? Oh, that's gonna bring them to me. That noise is horrible. Hello? Can I run now? Okay, it doesn't say what my task is. But I'm gonna... Walk around. Okay, well that went towards my van, I'm assuming. Let's go. Did it hit my van? My hand... <laughs> oh, Jesus! Hello? Oh, run to the car. Run to the car. I'm pressing shift. I'm pressing shift. I'm pressing shift! <laughs> oh, stop the car. Oh, what did they do to it? They did something to my car. Holy crap, what did that come out of? It's huge! We're done. We're done. We're dead. How is nobody else seeing this? Oh, Christ. Come on, we have no legs. That's it, that's the demo over. In the full game, you'll find a large territory of the Greyswood farm and a full story of an alien abduction. Add the game to your wish list so you don't miss a discounted release. It's not actually out yet, I don't think. Um, I might be, I actually, I think I might be wrong. I think it might, it might be out. But I'll put a link in the description anyway so you can check the demo out at least because it's free. Uh, but it was horribly terrifying. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you let me know in the comments if you want me to play the full version. If it is out or when it's out, and I will. And if you did enjoy it, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. And if you're not subscribed already, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can see my future video uploads. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.